Welcome to IBC 2023. Discover game-changing innovations, explore new business models, and network with over 170 countries. Exploring groundbreaking innovation across 13 halls right here in Amsterdam. Ashley within Broadcast, joining me is Andrew of Magnica. Hello. Hi, how are you doing? I'm very good, Great. thank you. So tell me, how does Magnica fit into the, in, uh, to the industry right now in the broadcasting and media market? Well, I think we're a, a huge innovator in the uh, area of the transport and control uh, aspects of the, this industry. So SMPTE 2110, IPMX, and MMOS are core technologies that Magnica is not only developing products for, but we're also helping develop the open standards. So um, we're at that kind of technology layer, and um, we, we help other companies bring products to market. So. Very good. And so what trends are you noticing as far as technology right now in the media and broadcasting market? Well, I think it's fair to say that 172110 has, you know, been successful at its original, you know, purpose, which is going into broadcast. And I think now what we're seeing is people seeing it as having a desire to put 172110 into more places, and that's a big part of the IPMX initiative is bringing that technology into the pro AV world, and also not only bringing it into new markets, but also bringing it to new people that maybe they don't have the same technology budgets as your larger corporation. So we want to make the technology more accessible so that anytime you're reaching for um, you know, AV over IP or media over IP, you're going to pick an open standard, and you're going to pick 172110 and IPMX, and hopefully use our chips in there too. So, Definitely. yeah. And so do you have any new current products or solutions here that you have at IBC or that you're currently highlighting? Well, I mean, we have a suite of technologies and they keep evolving and, and we're adding new capabilities to them. So um, it's a lot of, you know, what we've shown and also some new things uh, in terms of our integrations and with software, we're showing uh, Unity and um, um, Unity, what's the other one? Uh, Unreal Engine uh, integration um, with our M2S SDK, which works on Windows and Mac. Um, and then we're also showing uh, um, that that integration in different software platforms and also working with our SMPTE 2110 uh, IP and also our um, ME10 SOC, which is a uh, one, um, uh, one gig IPMX uh, solution. So um, yeah, we're showing that all together in one working demo, um, yeah. So what territories would show an interest in your products or who's your, what territory are you focusing on? Um, well, we're sort of focusing on manufacturers that are looking to bring um, IP technology, uh, again, as I said, you know, into, into new markets and into new applications. So um, we're looking for people that are, um, you know, they're trying to innovate with it, maybe trying to do something that hasn't been done in the past, like for example, maybe weird resolutions or bringing laptops into live production and stuff like that. You know, we make that really easy. Um, and our, you know, our dream is that you know people can unbox these kind of products and just use them in a very easy and accessible way. Um, and I think that um, you know our work in the standards and our work in our our technology is kind of enabling that. Um, so we're looking for people that are trying to bring this technology to markets that um, you know would love to jump in, but they're hanging on to SDI because it's a little easier to understand and maybe fits their budget more. We want those customers. So yeah. What would you say we could expect from Magnica in the near future? Well, I mean, as we continue to work with the other companies that are developing the open standards, I think you're going to see um, the, the whole, all of the standards improve and all of those standards become more and more popular and we're going to be a huge part of that. And as we, as we bring that about, we want to make sure that you have the components and the IP and the software that you need to build products using those open standards. So I think... Um, you know, essentially that's that's kind of the core of our business, but also too we have um, our, our software SDKs not only work on the PC platform, but of course also in the cloud as well. And we're going to see um, people that want to do on-premise things and any you know any premise or off or on-premise right in the cloud. Um, that's that's a big part of our future as well. So yeah. Well, thank you so much for all that information. You can check out more on their website. Hope you have a great rest of the show. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah.